Dale mami baila, estás bien rica, bien rica mami baila, estás bien rica, bien rica mami baila, estás bien rica, bien rica mami baila. In August of 2021, I had a big trip planned to visit my ex-boyfriend in Florida for his birthday. I had bought the tickets three months before. I was going to stay with his family. It was my first time on a plane, so his grandmother was coming with me. We were close. We used to go shopping together, and we would go out to eat. She was like a third grandmother to me. I already had my luggage packed. I had gone shopping for lots of gifts. Then, just a few days before the trip, he told me that I needed to get vaccinated. His family didn't want me traveling with his grandmother if I wasn't. It felt like I was being forced. I didn't feel ready to take the vaccine. It hadn't been out for very long. My mom is a home healthcare worker and was happy to get the vaccine. But my aunt told us how she didn't trust the vaccine and she was sending me articles and stuff that made me cautious about it. I was also seeing all the scary things that Instagram was saying about what would happen if you were vaccinated. I didn't want to be gullible. I never thought that I would never get the vaccine. I just wanted to give it more time to see what's going on. But I already booked the ticket and they were expecting me. So I got vaccinated. Thankfully, I didn't experience anything negative. I'm still not happy with feeling forced, but the pandemic was very stressful. It was good to get out of New York and I was excited to go to Florida. When the day arrived, all my worries and concerns about getting the vaccine faded. Me and his grandma got on a plane and I was happy to protect his grandmother and myself. I spent the days going out late, eating foods I never had before and sharing lots of love and making tons of memories. Although the process of getting vaccinated wasn't what I hoped it would be, overall, I'm happy that I got it done. Come on, we're